Hey guys! This video is all about Bangkok, which is the capital of Thailand. Um, I went to Thailand earlier this year from the middle of January to the middle of February and it was literally one of the best trips ever. Like I had so much fun and Bangkok was the starting point. It's a starting point for a lot of people because that tends to be um, where you fly into and a lot of people choose to spend very little time here. Um, I mean I met people who had left within like a day. Um, and to be honest, I don't blame them because Bangkok is really, really busy and quite polluted. But it's actually a really cool city. There's loads of things you can do. Um, there's loads of things to see. So yeah, here are a few things that you might want to check out. The Jim Thompson house is absolutely awesome. He was an American guy who revived the Thai silk industry. Rod Fine Market is also known as the Bangkok Train Market. It sells lots of vintage bits and bobs, also has bars, live music and places to eat. Chat to Chat Weekend Market sells everything you can think of, but it's pretty big so get there early. Don't forget to take advantage of the street food and check out all the other markets. The Grand Palace is amazing, but make sure you get there early because your ticket includes a coin pavilion and a museum of textiles. Although it has the steepest set of stairs I've ever climbed, make sure you check out Wat Alun for the amazing views across the Chao Phraya River. And don't forget Wat Po and the smaller temples. Make sure you take an evening boat ride on the river because the sunsets are stunning. Khao San Road is great for partying and having fun, but do not book anything through the travel agencies there because they are notorious for promising what they can't deliver and scamming people out of their hard-earned cash. I didn't get to do these things, but I've heard really good things and I've spoken to people who have done them and um, so you might want to check out the floating markets which are basically markets on the water but you have to get there really really early I think at like 4am or something like that they finish by like 11am but they sound really really cool definitely check that out and um, there's also a thing called dialogue in the dark which I wanted to go to you get to experience a small taster of what it's like to be blind but in order to go, you need a guide. And when I went there, they told me they didn't have any English speaking guides, but they didn't actually say this on their website that you needed a guide. If you want to go, definitely book in advance. It sounded really, really good. And I know they have it in other cities as well. So yeah, definitely check it out. There are loads of really cool shopping malls, like the whole Siam area, which has like three pretty big shopping malls. And they have like some really cool fountains and stuff outside. So definitely go and check those out. It's really really easy to get around Bangkok. I mainly use the SkyTrain and the Metro which are both really similar to London Underground and really really easy to use. And also there's the Chao Praia Express Boat. Make sure you get on the regular express boat and not the tourist boat because the tourist boat is twice as much and it basically does the same journey and it's not anything special. If you're going to go around by taxi, always ask the driver to use the meter. Don't let them just tell you the fare that is likely to save you a lot of money. If you're going to take tuk-tuks, make sure you bargain for your fare. It's a great experience, but often not the most cost-effective way to get around. Before you go anywhere, just read up on any scams that they do on tourists, just to make sure you don't fall victim. In terms of how much money you'll spend, I'm going to talk about that in a different video about budgeting for a trip to Thailand. Yeah, so if you're going to Thailand, definitely think about spending at least a few days in Bangkok because it's definitely worth it. Uh, take care and I will see you on the next video. Bye!